Hey guys, it's Di from Bee Mommy of Style. Today we're going to be moving some furniture into the Our Generation dollhouse that the girls got for Christmas. So you can see up there on the top level, the girls have one of the beds that they have. And down here on the lower level, they're kind of needing a living space so they can use this house a little bit more. So I had some of these items stood away. I'm going to show them in the dollhouse today and show how everything fits. We are really, really liking this Our Generation house. I think that it's a really great size for like four, five, six year old. They're just getting started. They especially really like the stairs that are over here on the side. And then also there's a really handy storage area over here. So what we're going to be putting in today is one of these locker chandeliers. I got these in Michaels when they were clearancing them out from back to school. And I was going to put it down here on the bottom, but honestly not looking at it, I think it's going to hang down so low it's going to be in the way for play. So the top seems to be a little bit higher, so I think we'll put this upstairs in the bedroom. Then the dolls need some place to eat, so I have this adorable retired sweet treat set from the 2007 or 2008 line at American Girl. This is now retired so you have to get it on the secondary market but it's so so cute. It's got the hearts. I also have a little sign here to hang up on the wall. It's like a little decoration. Happy Valentine's Day. Then I have one to hang up when it's not Valentine's Day as well. And also this couch from Ma Jean's Creations that I found on Etsy and I will link her down below. So for the locker chandelier, I'm just going to attach it with these command hooks. And then same thing with the sign. I'm going to use these clear command hooks over here on the pink wall. And then this is just a Velcro that I can attach to this top little bracket up here. So I'm going to show you what everything looks like in the girls' house. And they can get start playing for Valentine's Day. So for the Valentine's Day sign and the wall decorations, I just put one of those clear command hooks over here on the side. I'm going to hang that up on the wall. And then that's just going to hang there and be a wall decoration. So the next thing, I'm gonna go ahead and put the table and chair over here so the girls can pretend like the dolls are eating or it can be like a little conversation area. And then I'm gonna put the couch back here. This may move around a little bit, but this gives you a good idea of what will fit in here. So you can put this table and chair totally sideways if you want it to be like this and just have like a little bistro area over here and then a little couch and seating area over on that side. So then to put the chandelier in, I'm gonna use some of these Velcro strips and I'm gonna put this up on the very top. There's kind of like a little eave here. So I'm gonna open this up. The cool thing about these locker chandeliers is that they do actually light up. It's got a little switch up here and it has LED lights on it. So you can actually turn it on, it's really, really bright. And it adds some light and it actually has like a dimmer switch to where if it picks up that there's no light, so like if you turn the lights in the room off, it'll turn it on as well, which is pretty cool. So I'm going to hang this from up here. I'm hoping that one command hook will do it. That's still pretty low too. I'm trying to see which area would be like least in the way for play. We're going to try it up here and if it gets in the way, the nice thing about the Velcro is it's easily removable. So I use this Velcro all over the playroom for all sorts of different things and it's really, really strong. I've actually hung actual pictures with it. So I'm going to hang two strips actually up here to the top and fix it to the house first and then I'm going to stick the light to that and that'll make it strong. So I just took the backing off of the strips so they are stuck to the top there and I'm going to fix it to where the switch to turn it off and on is right here in the front. And I'm just going to press it and hold it for a few seconds since it's gonna be working against gravity here. And the nice thing is, is that these do work pretty quickly also. And then that is what the bedroom is gonna look like. And you can even use a little tape if you didn't like those things hanging down. I mean, I don't think even the girls are really gonna notice them after we get playing here. And then you have a cute light in the bedroom. I think it's really cute. So hopefully you guys enjoyed checking out our new additions to our Our Generation dollhouse that fits 18 inch dolls. I'm gonna do a full review on this once we've had it just a little bit longer, but the girls really do like this one and I think it's a really great size for their ages. So this is the view just a little bit back and you can kind of see the scale of everything. So that is gonna be it for today. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.